hello guys uh, in this video I will show you how to install the rain meter desktop uh, customization for Windows 10 rain meter software you can download it for free and you can customize your uh, desktop the idea of it uh, uh, you can cost uh, you can monitor uh, that uh, the date and the time and uh, the month and the year you can monitor it, uh, also the 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 system information the gpu uh, the cpu usage uh, the usage of the cpu the usage of the gpu and you can do many many things so here i will show you how and by uh, the important thing is uh, in terms of GNU gpl license so it is a richard stallman it's open source so it is very very nice it's better than uh, you know the in the top uh, in the bottom uh, left the traditional windows it will be in the your desktop so here i will show you how to do the uh, how to install the rain meter and how to create how to uh, how to create a, a basic schedule task to let this uh, this application run uh, every time you start up uh, your system your windows so you don't need uh, to run it manually. It will be startup automatically. Okay. So now we go to download and the final down, download the final one, not uh, the beta. So you press download and you download in the desktop and you go to your desktop and it is downloaded here. Right click, run as administrator. Run. Okay. Start the installation. Do not select this unless you know what you are doing. No. So, standard installation. Go. Go. And finish. So, now you have the, the rain meter. It's running here. Okay. You come here, you don't need this guy. Right click and unload skin. Okay. Then this the rain meter. Right click and you go to manage. You come here, you expand it, you go to the clock. So this is the clock. The first one, the clock, and you make edit. Maximize this window. You go down here, 24. Look, it is 24. We want to change it to AM PM. So to change it, uh, change the format to origin above to AM PM, to 12 hours, it means AM PM. Copy this, Control C, copy, go to format, space, past it, Control V, then copy this, then select this, Control X, and you go here, type two. 24 double column then control v okay so now control s save then control f4 close then refresh now the time change to for uh, to a m p m okay Here's the system usage. The CPU is 20%, 20 the RAM is 11%, and the swap is 5%. Okay? Now go to the setting, check update. So here, for example, we, ca we can drag it. We want to disable the drag, so disable the drag, so now we cannot drag it. Okay? You cannot drag. Is disabled okay user no you don't use it 
So let's see. For example, I want to see only the the clock. I don't want to check. Right? You can you can go to the system. Unload. Okay. Now go to the setting. Enable dragging, and you can make this disk up. We don't make it up. Okay, up. So you have the disks information. Now disable this guy again, and refresh all the lists. Now, if you are stuck, this uh, application will not uh, restart automatically. So to restart this application automatically, we have to create a schedule task bar. To create a schedule task bar, let's see where this application is installed. The location of this application. So it's name rain meter rain. Type rain in the search bar. Rain. So this is the application. Right click on it. Open file location. Look, this is the rain meter. Again, but this rain meter is in the programs. In the start menu of the programs is not the real location. It is the shortcut. So again, you make right click and open file location. Now, this is the right location of this application. Okay. Don't close this window. Press window key and type schedule task scheduler open it open the tasks schedule the scheduler the create basic task bar type z capital letter then name it for example you can name it any name but we let name it this rain meter Okay, name it rain meter with R. Then press next. Then when I log in, check when I log in. Okay, then press next. Then start a program, press next. Then a browser, the file. Where is the file? So the file is here. So you put the, uh, the, the pointer here and control C, copy. You go to the task scheduler again and you put the pointer here. You put the pointer here, highlight. Okay, when you highlight, control V and you press enter. So now you are, you are in, the, in the rain meter. Select the rain meter exe with the extension exe. Then press open. Now the rain meter is open. Now make next. Now select open. Select this. Check this. Open the properties dialog and make finish. Now you have this guy. So you have to customize the schedule taskbar. Run with high yes privilege. Check this and here select Windows 10. Then a trigger, don't play with it. Action, don't play with it. Action, don't play with it. Conditions. And check this. Settings. And check this. And check this. And now we are ready to go. Press OK. So we put the first letter of our uh, of it Z. So it will be always in the end. So refresh. OK. And let's see what happened when we make end. Exit from here. Run. Okay, now it is running. So now, whenever, uh, wherever you make the restart, restart your computer, this 
task will be triggered so it will run the application automatically and you can see your time your disk status and uh, uh, disk status uh, disk status and uh, let's uh, make also the cpu the gpu is important so here let's manage again go to manage expand this guy so system information load the system information so here we load the system information go to the setting and check this arrow dragging and you can drag the system information here okay so you have the system information the cpu usage 26 percent the ram usage 12 percent and the swap usage six percent okay now refresh again refresh again and again, let's put the system up and the disk down because system is more important than. Okay, let's make it. Ah, make it like this. It has to be stopped. Okay, he stopped. So now disable the dragging. Refresh all. Close. So now let's make Control A, Shift D, and yes. Uh, they are ah, sorry sorry here we are we are recording we cannot cancel here we are recording so guys uh, look now this uh, look nicer uh, the desktop is nicer instead of the ugly uh, uh, ugly date uh, clock here you have nice clock and uh, you have uh, the watch and you have the date and uh, here you have the uh, 24 of uh, 2020 and here they have the information of your system and if you press it it will open the taskbar of your system okay thank you guys i hope this video uh, is helpful and as always we hope that we learned something today and uh, stay safe fight covid19 Ciao raga, ci vediamo tutti, andrà tutti bene. Ciao.